Good afternoon to everyone. I'm here, IDA Investor Doctor Academy, IDA. So today is 14th of July and 2nd May of July. Uh, today we're gonna share about how the market, uh, futures market, uh, move for the last week and how we're gonna trade for the next week. Okay. So before we begin the um our sharing to today, uh, I will like to introduce our full course. So our full course is actually finally released. So our full course we will share about. Uh, ultimately, our objective is to help you to build your own trading plan. So what is the all what are all the elements in the trading plan? We are gonna teach you all about it. So it's not about it's not it's not only about technical analysis. So technical analysis is just part of it. So we will convert those and the technical analysis into a really practical things. It's not only the theory. Okay, we will apply those technical analysis in real trading. Okay, and then we combine with our money management and also our advanced trading techniques like Fibonacci, like Ilya Wave, okay, to help you to construct your own trading plan. And this trading plan we also we will teach uh, you how to back test and forward test your trading plan. Okay, so it's very useful and also this technical course later we will uh, provide a free fundamental analysis course. Okay, so this course will be conducted in English from 17 to 19 of August, three days. Okay, will be on 9 a.m. to 5 p.m. in our IDS Center in Shalom. So if you're interested, please contact our phone number 011-5353-7589 to know more details. Okay, on the other hand, if you're trading local futures now or you plan to trade local futures but you don't know how to do it and you want to improve your trading skills, now is your chance. Okay? Because if you are not free, not available to attend our technical course, you can be join our private group, private telegram group because inside there we will do some private coaching to all the members and also we will provide live trading signals and you have the chance to interact with other traders in the group which will indirectly help you to in, improve your trading skills okay but for the stage now it's only included local futures visit which is FKRI and FCPO okay so if you're interested also can contact our number to know more details Below this video, we actually include our free channel link. Okay, the, all of these channels are free, so please feel free to join it and please help us to like and share to let more people know that we have this such a um, communication platform and also it's free and can be learned more about futures trading. Okay, so the YouTube, Facebook, i3 uh, investor and Telegram channel link is actually included in uh, below this video. Okay, so if you have any questions, feel free to comment to PM and or contact us. Okay, you can also WhatsApp us. Alright. So basically we will cover five major uh, futures market. Malaysia included FKL and FCPO, and then the US included crude oil, gold, and Dow Jones. Okay. Why uh, because it um Every day we will send out the trading strategy for these five markets. Okay, and every month end we will compile all our trading strategies and we will show you how we perform for the for the last month. Okay, so uh, that's why we will focus on these five markets. Or if the market that you trade is not included in it, so please feel free to reach out to to us so we can we can discuss more. All right. So at first we look into the Malaysian market. The vertical line here is stand for the last Monday. So we can see here it create lower low, okay? It's break lower point. So it's a bearish week. Overall trend we can see here is a sideways to lower trend. So we uh we, we can we can from from here it's showing that the FKI the Malaysian market doesn't follow US market to rebound. Okay the, because the US market is very bullish in these two weeks. Okay, but the Malaysia didn't follow so so we follow the uh, we follow back the Malaysia sentiment. Okay, from a daily chart we can see here it doesn't have a uh, down wave yet, so it doesn't have a sell signal for now. So daily chart we stick to buy above one thousand seven hundred level. Okay, but for the hourly chart, uh, there is a potential technical correction if we continue to break lower low, which is last week low. So below one six seven zero level, I will go for short sell for the hourly chart. Okay, 
technical indicator also weakening so uh, maybe we'll try to test the support level first okay so watch out for this Fibonacci level next we move to FCPO so uh, one thing about the FCPO is that FCPO gonna change the active month uh, by tomorrow which is Monday 15th of July okay so from here I will start using to analyze the October chart okay so this is October chart huh? please be noted okay so daily chart I will start showing the same because it, uh, if it hit lower low so it's a bearish trend okay but watch out it because the daily chart got a RSI bullish divergence we wait for the price action to confirm okay Bollinger Band narrowing so it's possible the price will move within the, the Bollinger Band range okay so for now the hourly chart and daily chart showing the same thing below 1940 level go for short sell okay the upside uh, we see will be around 2070 the previous height which also the 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 top of the Bollinger Band so uh break ab ab above this level likely to trigger a rebound okay so here we finish the Malaysian market let's move to the US market so this is WTI crude oil okay last week is uh, quite a good week we can see here the rebound sustain up above the middle line Bollinger Band and then hit higher high okay so it's a more to bullish trend still in re rebound stage okay but we can see here the last two days uh, was in dodgy form of candlestick okay Do dodgy meaning that the buyer and seller is not strong enough okay so uh, the <coughs> so we, we watch out if any reversal from this level okay which, because this are uh, still around the double top pattern and also which are around 61.8 or 51g level so we watch out for this okay so for daily chart we can see here below 56 will trigger a double top bearish pattern but for now not yet okay so daily chart is still more to bullish above 61 go for buy okay for hourly chart there is a potential technical correction below 559.9 so uh, for our chart same above 61 buy below 59.9 short sell for technical correction next us go okay us go we can see here the technical indicators actually weakening why because um the goal it had been in sideways since 20 something of june okay so it's around so it's already near one month the market in sideways okay being in in a very wide range which which is one three eight four to one four four three so we wait for more breakup okay daily and are we just showing the same thing is is it in a large sideway overall trend is sideways to bullish okay so any <clears throat> short term trading signal intraday we will update in our chain <clears throat> okay so at last mini Dow Jones mid Dow Jones is a very bullish wave because it hit historical high so we can see here for last Monday okay the last three days it will continue to shoot up and break higher high so it's a bullish trend our wave chart also showing the same thing okay so above 27330 I will go for buy okay but watch out because the daily chart and our wave chart the SI still in overbought so there's a possible uh, a technical correction in short term okay but for now uh, it doesn't seem to appear any reversal pattern yet okay so any update in the Dow Jones trend we will continue to update in our channel <clears throat> so we already finished our sharing let me do some summary for today's sharing so FKLI daily and hourly chart is showing the same thing okay RSI is in over uh it re retreat from the RSI overbought okay so we can uh go to buy above 1700 for both chart okay but our chart showing a potential technical correction so below 1670 is a sell call okay for for our chart for FCPO both our chart and the chart showing a bearish trend so below 1940 short sell okay for US WTI crude oil is in a re rebound stage okay slightly more to bullish all right so as long as the crude oil above 56 so daily chart and hourly chart um the buy signal will be on buy above 61 and then the hourly chart I have a potential technical correction so below 59.9 can try to short sell comments go okay daily chart and hourly chart both both in a wide 
sideways range okay in between 1384 to 1443 so any intraday trading signal we will update in channel okay and at last mini Dow Jones mini Dow Jones hit his historical high so okay so both daily chart and hourly chart are more to bullish so uh showing the same signal by above 27330 okay but both chart also in ISI overbought situation so we need to watch out if any technical correction or uh, profit taking in short term in next week all right so here done with our sharing so please help us to like and share our channel with the, the link is already included below this video and also the like I mentioned just now if you're interested in our building a trading plan future tra trading plan full cost okay or our private group to learn to trade a uh, local future such as FQIM CPO feel free to contact our phone number 011-5353-7589 I will see you guys next week thank you very much